Hello, this is Tony Payne, co-founder and CEO of Highlight, and I would like to highlight some of the new capabilities we introduced in this week's release of the Highlight Intelligence Hub. You can now specify the directories where all runtime application data files, as well as files associated with our brand new store and forward feature, are located. By default, directories point to the same folder where the application files are stored. To modify these directories, simply edit the application settings file shown here. Change the directory paths to your desired locations and save the file. You will need to restart the runtime for any changes to take effect. In addition to supporting OPC, MQTT, and Sparkplug, we have added several new connection options. Highbyte Intelligence Hub now supports native outbound support to AWS IoT SiteWise and Azure IoT and Event Hub. We also added inbound and outbound support for Rust-based web services, Microsoft SQL, MySQL, and Postgres. All connections now support Store and Forward. Store and Forward ensures the reliable delivery of outbound publish or write requests to a connection's outputs. In the event a publish request fails, it is queued and tried again later. You can specify how many requests per output are stored and how long to wait before retrying a failed publish request. Once the publish exceeds, the Store and Forward queued is emptied as quickly as possible, ensuring that each publish is successful before moving on to the next. We have added a new model attribute type called any. If you do not know what type of data will be read from a connection, or you wish to embed a complex data value within the model, select this type. Highbyte Intelligence Hub will convert the data type for you and make it available to the consuming applications. Updates to the user experience make configuring your project easier. One enhancement is a new and improved references browser. Simply select the connection of interest and find the inputs you want to bind to an instance's expression. Simply drag and drop or double click the reference to insert it in the selected expression. Thank you for watching this week's release highlights. To learn more about Highlight Intelligence Hub, please contact us.